Hello and welcome. In today's video we are going to look at a new feature that rolled out recently that kind of snuck under the radar and it is quite an awesome feature which allows you to uh, do bulk editing directly into your backlog. So let's jump into it and let me show you what it is. So here we are now in uh, my backlog for my test team, uh, just to show you what this one looks like. You have probably already seen and uh, that you can check these little boxes here and you will have the, the possibility to select all or to clear all. So if I select three of these, for example, you will see that we now have the little edit button here. And if I click on that one, you will actually see some bulk editing. So let me just move myself over to the left corner here so I don't block your view. Like that. Uh, so here you can see now uh, we now have the possibility to change the values for all three of the items that we have already selected. Uh, so these are the ones that are currently available to me but I can also find new fields here. So anything that I want uh, to find here, so if I want to change sprint for them for example I can do that and you see when I click on that one uh, a new field actually pops up below here and if I remove it then it will be gone. So the way it works, I can now set an assignee, I can sign it to myself, and I can set a due date. Let's set it for tomorrow, for example. And even if I want it, I can now keep, uh, I can add labels here, so I can add to existing, or I can replace, or clear. You might see that this one, for example, have clear existing, then it will take all of the fields, and it will remove uh, the flag on them in this case. So if I just do this and I say I want to change the sign for everyone and I want to set a due date for it and then I can uh, just click on next and it will basically ask me do I want to spam everyone with emails or do you want to just do this uh, peacefully uh, without bothering anyone. So if I just click on this one because uh, I don't want to send out an email and I click on confirm and you will see now then we have now bulk edit. I have assigned these to me and they all now have uh, a due date assigned to them. Now this is an exceptionally good change, uh, one of the best quality of life uh, improvement I have seen in a very long time and I really really like this one because it was always uh, a good that you can just jump over to the filters and you can just search for items and bulk change them. But there are many times when you are doing, for example, when you are planning your sprint or when you are planning things in the backlog or you just quickly want to update multiple tasks or our stories at the same time and this will really help in those situations. So I think this is a two thumbs up kind of uh, improvement and it's kind of interesting that it just flew under the radar because I would have expected this one to get a lot more attention than it has. But good work Atlassian and keep up uh, adding those kind of new features for us and we will be even more happier uh, as administrators in your products. So that was all for today. I hope you enjoyed this short video today. And as always, have an awesome day and a great week.